Seven Days continues its mission by spreading kindness. And this morning, students at Shawnee Mission South are hosting a kindness walk in the school's gym. And that's where we find Fox Force Tia Johnson. She joins us live from there. Good morning, Tia. Hey, good morning, Pat and Christelle. This walk has been going on for about 15 minutes now, and they planned this weeks ago, but I believe recent events show the importance of having these kindness walks. So Mark Ziegler is here with me. Mark, you kind of helped plan this walk that's going on today. Kind of tell us the importance of, you know, doing this at school. So the importance of this walk is that it's through Seven Days, which is an organization that was founded after an act of racial hate, but even though that was about nine years ago, hate still continues to exist today, and definitely recent events have influenced this because there was um, Bishop Miege was vandalized, Blue Valley was vandalized, I know there was a couple threats against Blue Valley North, so having this walk shows awareness that, you know, kindness is very important and that it needs to be a part of our day-to-day -day lives. What message do you think this sends the community to see high school students participating in the kindness walk? I think it shows that, you know, even though we are focused on studies and stuff like that, we can still be kind and we need to show kindness. And so what I'm hoping this message shows is that children are a big part of the kindness, like they want to help. And so I'm hoping this can show people that, you know, we can do this and just help with like future acts of hate and helping stop it. And then Mark, last question. We know that being kind can go a long way and it's really simple to be kind. Why is it good to, you know, practice that in high school with, you know, teenagers and stuff? So practicing kindness in high school is super important because, I mean, as you get older, you are going to meet people who you have who you clash heads with. But it's important to show kindness to them, even if, you know, you don't like them. And that will hopefully influence them to be kind to you, not only you, but also others. And it will hopefully just create this giant ripple that, you know, kindness is infinite. It will spread. And so you can see the kids participating in that uh, kindness walk here right now. They'll be doing this for about 20 more minutes, and we'll still be here throughout the morning to talk to more students about this kindness walk. We'll share more later on um, in the 9 o'clock show. Sending it back to you guys in studio. All right, Tia Johnson live in Overland Park this morning. What a great way to just bring awareness to kindness. Thanks so much, Tia.